The broadcast is now starting. All attendees are in listen-only mode. Hey there, everybody. Welcome, welcome, welcome. It's David Newman, and you are in the right spot for Pivot and Flex. Take your business online now. And while we're here, just want to have a little audio video check. Make sure that you can see the slide here that says Masterclass Series, and there's my mug up there. And then the pivotandflex.com is the URL. If you are uh, on Facebook, on Twitter, you want to share this out, send people to pivotandflex.com. Let your friends know that you're here. Uh, we welcome them with open arms. If you want to share this on all of your social channels, tweet it out, pivotandflex.com, Twitter, Facebook, LinkedIn, Instagram, whatever, Pinterest, Snapchat, TikTok, any platform, <laughs> any platform you want, it is shareable. But I do want to make sure that you can uh, both hear and see what's going on here. Do me a huge favor, pop into the question box. If you can hear it loud and clear, see it loud and clear, please just pop a yes into there. And uh, I see Tuli's here, Mike, thank you. Alan, Peter, Kia, Gary, Sandy, Helen, Keith, uh, Nancy, Karen, Cooksey's in the house, Iverson's in the house, good heavens, all-star, all-star lineup. And Derek and Charlie and Neil, Neil Dunsmore, the famous, the famous Neil Dunsmore, totally awesome. And Michael, Andrea, Veronica, Catherine, Bud, Bill, the 800-pound gorilla, is here. Colette, Linda Ann, Veronica, Paul, Riley, Catherine. Margaret Reynolds, another rock star. Another fantastic, stellar light in the consulting universe. And Steve and Lou, excellent. Really, really glad to have you. Well, I'm glad that the audio and the video is working. Like I said, pivotandflex.com is what to share out. To your friends and colleagues, let them know what you're up to here. Share the love. Get them in on this with us so that we can help them take their business online just like we're going to help take your business online in the next little bit of time here. I've got the top of the hour. Let's jump right in and we will start to rock and roll here. Quick poll. And I know some of you that I just called out there in the chat, but some of you I might not know. Are you primarily working as a consultant, a coach, a trainer, or a speaker? Now, you might be doing more than one of these things, but the question is, please pop in the question box, what is the primary source of your revenue? Are you primarily a consultant? And that's where most of the money comes from. Primarily a coach. Maybe you also do some training and speaking. Primarily a trainer, meaning you do workshops and seminars and training sessions. Primarily a speaker, on stage keynote speaker, main stage speaker. Uh, maybe you do training and coaching and consulting as well. But which one of these is primary? Which one is worth the lion's share of your typical monthly income? Let's see what people are saying here. Uh, we've got a couple of slashes, a couple of hyphenated hybrid, consultant coach, becoming a coach, speaker, speaker and trainer, says Ariel. Uh, Steven says speaker. The other Steve says speaker. Anil says coach. Helen says coach. Keith says coach. Okay, so quite a mix. This is great. Our consultants are now chiming in. Consultants bringing up the rear. Consultants coming on strong. So Margaret's consulting. Matt's consulting. Sandy is consulting. Ned Miller, great to see you. Coach slash consultant. All right, beautiful. So this is going to impact everything in your business model and revenue model. And obviously the elephant in the room, at least the elephant in the room for your client base and your prospect base is the COVID-19 global pandemic. I'm curious, some folks are affected a little, some folks are affected medium, some folks obviously affected a lot. If a lot of events have disappeared from your calendar, your calendar has been wiped clean, Obviously, with no live events, no gatherings of any kind, there's no workshops, there's no seminars, there's no keynotes, there's no conferences, other people already have somewhat of a virtual model or an at-distance remote model. 
I'm curious for you personally, and just again, pop this in the uh, question box. How have you been affected? Because we've all been affected, obviously, personally, professionally, emotionally. Uh, we're isolated. We're quarantined. We've lost some friends, probably. Um, people are getting sick worldwide. So terrible, terrible tragedy. But from a business standpoint, cancel and postponed events, uh, income, your prospecting has been affected when your prospect's hair is on fire, sales activity that might not have been strong before has now gone to zero. Tell me a little bit, just with a couple of keywords and short phrases, what has been the impact of COVID-19 on your particular business, given your business model, your revenue model, and the clients and prospects that you serve? Obviously, prospects laying off half their workforce, um, you know, major hospitality, airline travel, hotels, those industries are devastated. If that's your industry, you're going to feel this more than if it's somewhere else. I'm just curious, overall, uh, what is going on here with you? So we've got postponed workshops, workshops canceled, says Carrie, lost three to four months of work, says Scott. Everything is gone, says Thomas. All my speaking gigs wiped out, says Shelly. Prospecting is dead, and we're going to fix that, Keith, for you. Denise says all of the above. Jen says all business wiped out. Um, some in-person coaching has been put off, says Linda Ann. Events canceled across the board. Yeah, so it's bad. Now, I want you to also remember that our prospects, this is a picture of a prospect. It's not a picture of a consultant coach speaker. Our prospects have this elephant sitting in their lap right now. So everything that we do, everything that we say, everything that we sell, needs to be dialed in to this prospect who is under tremendous duress, tremendous strain, tremendous pressure, and tremendous anxiety and uncertainty. And we're going to circle back to that messaging and how our messaging needs to pivot and how our services need to flex and all of those different things. But thank you for sharing uh, so freely in the question box. Here's our game plan for today. We're going to talk about how to survive, pivot, and prevent further losses uh, how to help our prospects preserve their sanity and protect their career and pull the nose up on the plane before it's too late for them. How to avoid some sales landmines in the current environment. We are going to talk about fees, cash, money, how you can charge what you're worth and how you can do that now more than ever. And how to increase your reach and revenue, not only despite the current conditions, but because of them and then some next steps to help you make it happen. So that's our overall game plan for our time together today. And at the end, we're going to have a massive q and I will answer any and all questions that you have. I will stay here until I outnumber you, and I want to make sure that you get everything that you need from this deep dive training. So we're going to be here, get comfortable, get a beverage, get several beverages, Line up a couple of coffees, a couple of teas, a couple of cans of your favorite sparkling beverage. Uh, we are going to settle in and we're going to move fast. We're going to cover a lot of ground very quickly. And let's get right into it. Keys to the new normal. Keys to the new normal. The first thing that you need to understand is that our prospects need caring and empathy and relevance to everything that you do, every touch point. Every marketing message, every sales message, every outreach message, every relationship message, even if you've got nothing to market or sell, and we'll talk about the do's and the don'ts of that a little bit later on, but the first thing that we need to add to everything that we're doing is a new level of caring, a new level of empathy, and a new level of relevance. We're going to talk about some remote program design that you can deliver and that will be received well, uh, how to have scale and leverage built into this new remote virtual program design model, and resetting your mindset to disconnect your value from your personal time, attention, and presence, and how during this time especially, how you can preserve your earning power and maybe even grow it when other people are suffering, losing business left and right, losing revenue, bank accounts drying up, 
really terrible time for folks that are not pivoting and not shifting. Let me share an ancient Chinese saying with you. The ancient Chinese saying, uh, and maybe it came from a fortune cookie, I don't know, a bend in the road is never fatal unless you fail to turn. Let me repeat that for you. A bend in the road, and this is a huge bend, there's a big U-turn happening, but a bend in the road is never fatal unless you fail to turn. And today, this masterclass training is all about helping you make that turn, make that pivot, maybe even get ahead of the curve so you're positioned better after this crisis than you were before. The good news is you can get going on that right now. And let's do a quick audit. Quick audit is how much of your business is online, how much of your business is in person. It goes from a scale of zero to 100. 0% online right now. I'm going to ask you to pop into the question box here and tell me which one this is after I share this with you, very high level. 0% online, meaning you've got no webinars, no videos, you've got no online courses, no remote delivery capacity, no remote delivery strategy, and you're 100% dependent on live events and your personal presence to generate revenue. 100% online right now, meaning that you regularly do webinars, you have lots of video assets and you do lots of new video on a weekly basis. You've got one or more flagship online courses. You are 100% remote delivery right now and you have zero dependence on live events. Zero to 100, odd numbers are fine. Where are you on the scale? 20s, 30s, 40s, 77, 26, 48, if you're up in the 80s, 90s, or 100, God bless you. We are so lucky and so privileged that we are on the 100% in our business. We are 100% online. I made that decision in 2013 because I wanted to have a 100% online business model. And now in 2020, this is a necessity. This is a necessity at least to have the capability to flex to an online model and never be dependent on live events ever again for your livelihood. But I'm curious, pop in the chat, where are you on the scale? I know some folks are at zero, some folks are in the 70s, 80s. We got some folks that are 50s, 60s, 66.6666666, that's a good answer. Let's see what other answers are popping in here. So where are you on the spectrum? Uh, Jen says she's at zilch, Deborah's around a 10, Karen is 70. Uh, Catherine says 10%, Jess says 50, Joe says 20%, Lois is 0% online, Riley is 10% online, Fabio is 10, uh, Scott is another 66%, Pam is 0, Keith is 80, good for you, that's awesome, uh, Colette says 55.5%, 20% online says Kenneth, Eric is 75, Denise is 10, Karen is 60, jo Joanna is 77, uh, Paul is 15, Ned is 33, Rick is... I love these creative numbers. Uh, Rick is uh, 17, Ned is 33, Connie's 40%. Uh, Margaret says flipped from 100% live to 100% virtual over the next 60 days, and then you're going to flip back to 80-20 live. Wow, very interesting. Nice pivot. Rita says 85 Jessica says 25, Sandy says 20% with tons of video. Okay, great. Well, now you know where you are, and then we're going to look at additional pivots and shifts that you can make to ensure that we're not caught flat-footed again, and then we can start making revenue immediately with some high-fee online programs that I'm going to show you how to unpack, create, build, market, monetize, and sell. My own business evolution, if you've been on webinars with me before, you've seen some version of this. I'll just go through this very, very quickly. First three years, I just did two things. I did speaking and training, and I was bad at, bad at selling both. Uh, totally going broke, no idea what I was doing. Took three years to figure that out till about 2005. 2005 to 2008, still did the speaking and training, but then I added one-on-one -on -one coaching. And one-on-one -on -one coaching was great because that was kind of the insurance policy that even when some other things were not working, I always had this one-on-one -on -one profit center that I could rely on. 
2009, I started doing group coaching with live led groups. And we'll talk more about that as we get rolling. 2012, I started doing webinars for both leads and sales webinars. 2014, I turned off my one-on-one -on -one coaching completely, really doubled down onto group coaching. And that's when I added the high fee mentoring that we're going to talk about for you today. And then in 2015, I added the high fee masterminds. The items that are in green are the ones that we're going to talk about building for you today. So group coaching, online mentoring, high fee mentoring, and high fee masterminds that are 100% virtual, 100% remote, and do not rely on you showing up anywhere, anytime in person, unless you want to. And I love, I love showing up at live events. I go to conferences. We host our own private events for our clients. Uh, we do all kinds of other things in person when we can do things in person. So I love doing that. I just no longer need to do that. And you might love doing that. And you might not want to need to do that, have to do that anytime that you, uh, you know, don't want to uh, or, or you're not able to. So doing it on a voluntary basis as an added revenue stream, that's great. Doing it when you have to and the events have dried up and the conferences and the live meetings of any kind have been hit like they were in 2001, like they were in 2008, like they are now in 2020, you do not want the next act of terrorism or God forbid the next financial uh, meltdown, deep, long-term recession, which we may or may not be getting into. I'm not an economist. I don't play one on TV. But whatever it is, you do not want to be the victim of circumstance. And what we're going to build here for you is your safeguard against that, very specifically. Now, here's another problem with one-on-one. -on -one. It doesn't really scale. This is torn right from my calendar in 2013, 27 one-on-one -on -one meetings. That is more than five meetings every weekday. I was wall to wall on the phone with clients. Now you might say, hey, that's great, but that has a natural ceiling. My natural ceiling was about $225,000 back when I was doing this in 2013. I couldn't make any more money because I couldn't sell any more time. Does that sound familiar to anyone? Here is the math behind that. Back in the day, seven, eight years ago, I would charge $4,500 for 90 days of one-on-one. -on -one. I had 10 to 12 active clients at any time. You can do the math on that. So that's about every quarter. So 40 to 50 clients a year, that maxed out at 180 to $225,000. The problem was that I didn't have a life. I was 60 plus hours on the phone, some days didn't have time to eat, didn't have time to go to the bathroom. Not pretty. No freedom, no scale, no time off. Now, I know for some of you, $180,000 to $225,000 a year, that would be a pay cut. And I get it. For some of you, you go, oh my God, I wish I could get to $180,000. I wish I could book myself wall to wall with paying clients and I didn't have any empty spots on my calendar. What I'm suggesting here strategically is be careful what you're asking for and be careful of the business model that you're building because sooner rather than later, you will hit that ceiling and you will have nowhere to go and you will have built yourself a job instead of building yourself a business that is scalable and replicable and that you can work with other people and many more people for many higher uh, dollar figures. All of that financial stuff we're going to cover later on. The other problem, of course, is with a non-scalable business, when you stop, the money stops. Not good. When you stop, the money stops. That's the definition of a job, by the way. Definition of a job is when you stop, the money stops. The definition of a business is you as the CEO or the owner of that business. You do not need to be physically present to operate that business. The business can go on and continues to sell and market and deliver and help clients without your personal time, attention, and presence. So here's the question for you. Please pop this in the question box. Based on what we just shared, looking at your business model in the cold, harsh light of day, do you now feel that you might be selling your time and you might be building yourself a job, whether it's profitable or not? And then what do you think your financial cap is? If you were fully wall-to-wall, -wall, like I was fully wall-to-wall -wall 
back in 2012, 2013. I was maxed out at about 225K. I could not make more if I wanted to. So for some people, your financial cap might be 500K, 350, 175. Are you selling your time? And then pop into the question box, what do you think that simple math calculation is if you were fully booked in your current business model what is the ceiling? What is the cap on that revenue? So 125, 200, 200, 250, 350, 500K, 300K, 425. These are great numbers. 125, uh, 90K. Wow. So 90K needs to raise your rates. Uh, 150, another 150, 175. Those are the numbers. To get past that and to scale, past that, you need a system and a distribution method for your intellectual property that is not delivered one-on-one -on -one, and that's scalable and virtual and remote and COVID-19 friendly. And that's what we're going to build for you today. Now, speaking of COVID-19, let's talk about the current environment that your clients are living in and that your prospects are living in. The number one thing is fear anxiety, and uncertainty. Their old priorities are completely out the window, completely gone. They are rightly or wrongly, and I'm going to say rightly, freaked out. They have no idea if they're going to be employed next week, employed next month. Will they lose their job? Will they do another round of layoffs and job cuts? Will they lose all their customers? Will their company even survive? A lot of our clients a lot of our associations, companies, corporations, conferences, they are literally in an existential fight for their existence. Well, how do you connect with someone like that? How do you, what messaging do you need? What, what outreach do you do when you're trying to help them break through the noise, gain attention, and start to build a relationship with folks or even start to reconnect with folks that might be your past clients? How do you do that? when they're totally paralyzed by fear. Now, let's unpack this. What do you and I do? Think of a personal downturn. Think of when we're in crunch time. What would you do? And we're gonna talk about some crisis psychology here and crisis behavior. The first thing they're gonna do is they're gonna cut discretionary spending. So what that means for you is, for your programs, you need to immediately move out of the nice to have category and immediately move in to the have-to-have category. They're going to do everything they can to reduce costs and extend their runway. They've already made cuts. They're probably going to cut again. They're probably going to cut some budget. They're going to cut some. They're going to reallocate some things. They're going to furlough some staff. They're going to lay off more people. They're looking to do everything they can to extend their runway. They are totally risk-averse right now everything they can to reduce risk. They're in hunker down mode. Anything that you're talking about with growth and uh, speed and acceleration and innovation and all these great positive growth words that we used to use are totally tone deaf. They're totally tone deaf. They're totally inappropriate. You need to stop using them immediately. And we need to understand that they're also very much in follow the herd mentality. So they say, oh, our closest competitor cut all their conferences and events. We have to cut all our conferences and events. This other competitor, they dropped all their consulting contracts. We have to drop all our consulting contracts. And finally, it's very important that your marketing and your messaging avoids complexity. Simple was always the best way to go. Now simple is the only way to go. Because if you're going to put a sharp tip of the arrow through the messaging and you're going to have to pierce the veil of uncertainty, fear, doubt, complexity, etc., the marketing message needs to be simpler than ever. So please, plain English, talk prospect language about prospect problems. We must avoid complexity in your messaging. Because of this crisis behavior... Let's talk about how to adapt your message right here, right now. You can take a screenshot of this. We're going to revisit this a little bit later on. But you need new nouns and new verbs. In order to connect with prospects that are thinking and prioritizing the things we just talked about, 
your message needs to use the following verbs. Extend, preserve, protect, safeguard, survive, restore, reboot, pivot, flex. Why do you think this webinar is called Pivot and Flex? That's what we need to be doing. That's probably what's on your mind. That's why this webinar is called Pivot and Flex. If they're interested in extending, preserving, protecting, and safeguarding, the way that you now talk about your value prop, the way that you frame the new context around your content needs to match exactly what they're thinking. Extend, preserve, protect, safeguard, survive, restore, reboot, pivot, flex. Some new nouns that we need to use. Change, turbulence, turmoil, trouble, uncertainty, downturn, crisis. I'm going to show you how to use these in a moment, but this is what they're experiencing. This is the conversation they're having in their heads. We need to relate to that conversation. We need to mirror that conversation, and we need to convey that we understand what they're going through, and this service, this program, this virtual training, this high-fee mentoring program, this mastermind, this, this um, uh, webinar series, this video series, whatever we want to do virtually and remotely is exactly what they want for exactly why they want it. So these are the words that they're resonating with. These are the nouns, change, turbulence, turmoil, trouble, uncertainty, downturn, crisis. The number one key to results is take whatever you were doing three to four months ago and set that aside. The old mindset, the old value prop, the old messaging, that's got to go. If you're marketing the same way you were marketing in January of 2020, you are not going to get any traction. You're not going to open any conversations. You're not going to get into any doors. It is very important that we retool everything that we're selling and everything that we're saying in the way that I just shared with you. Because think about it. Do your prospects need more panic? Or do they need more help? And by the way, I think you're still out of toilet paper. I think they need more help. I think they need more help now more than ever, and they do not need more panic. They need you to show up like a white knight or a white princess or a white queen on some kind of white horse. Pick your royalty, but you should be on a white horse. And you are the hero that comes onto the scene as a source of help. Relevant, immediate, current, and torn from the headlines. This is how we need to recontextualize your expertise. Now, normally, this might be bad enough if we don't resonate with our target market and we don't have effective messaging for our clients. Think about these nightmare prospects. Maybe I'm the only one that has had these, but think about getting a decision from someone who's not really committed, not really excited about what you do. Here's what that sounds like. Oh, I have to think about it. Oh my goodness, we can't afford that. You know, it sounds great. That's just not for us right now. Maybe we'll do this next year. We're going to go in a different direction. Oh my goodness. Now, maybe it is just me, but help me out here. Type yes if you've ever had that experience of the nightmare prospect who just won't decide, pushes you off, delays, disappears, uh, does the song and dance, um, kind of comes back once in a while, just enough to be annoying, but they never pull the trigger. They've been dancing around. It's avoidance. It's all kinds of crazy nonsense. Again, maybe it's just me. Maybe you've never had this, but if you have had this, help a brother out. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, with lots of S's. Yes, with lots of exclamation points. Okay. I'm feeling better now. I thought it was just me. I thought it was just me. Here's what's worse about these type of folks. Even when they hire you, these are the nightmare prospects who become nightmare clients. They don't see the value. They push back on your fees. They, they nickel and dime you. They don't do the work. They don't show up for calls. They don't show up for the training sessions. They don't implement when you've left the building, and they obviously don't get results. One of the little mantras that I share with our clients all the time, it's amazing the results you do not get from the work you do not do. Have you ever had a client like this where they sign on, but then they go totally passive? They just don't do the work, don't show up on calls, don't attend the training. Type the word oi if you've had that experience. Type the word oi, or as my people like to say, 
Oy vey. Oy vey. Holy smokes. Uh, these are the worst clients. They are the highest maintenance, the hardest to please. They never refer. They never recommend. Uh, you're always chasing them from some kind of payment or paperwork or deliverable. Uh, it's just a horrible, horrible experience. And I'm seeing lots of oys in the question box. So thank you. Oy, oy, oy with lots of exclamation points. Oy vey with lots of whys. Thank you for using the complete phrase. Yeah, that's the problem. That's the problem that we're up against if we're enrolling the wrong kinds of people for the wrong kinds of reasons. Now, let's talk about why this happens. And we're going to unpack this in light of your high-fee programs here in a minute, your high-fee virtual and remote programs. When you accommodate a low-fee client, they immediately connect you with a low-value solution. That means they hold you in low respect. They have low expectation of your work. They put forth a low effort. Thus, they get low results. And this is the kind of client who is exhausting and depressing. Now, if we look at the flip side of this, your premium clients who are coming in for high fee programs, when they pay a high fee, they immediately associate you and your programs with high value, meaning that they now hold you in high respect. They have high expectation of the outcomes of your work. They put a high effort into implementing your advice. Thus, they get high results. And this kind of client is always energizing, fun, and profitable to work with. Always. Now, do you want the first kind of client or do you want the second kind of client? Regardless of fees, it is much more fun to deal with high fee clients who have ultimate respect. They're a dream to work with. They're super compliant. You say jump, they say how high. And for that reason, they get amazing and rapid results. And that's the business that we're in. Now, let me tell you about Copy Green, who came through one of our programs. She has some nice things to say up at the top here. Tremendous value, <laughs> direct, no BS, to the point, and honest. Uh, processes are bulletproof, action-oriented. You help us get results. My part of this that's my favorite is the one I highlighted in yellow. Using the tools I developed with your guidance, I locked in a $60,000-plus contract. The reason I share this with you, it's because it doesn't make sense in today's environment to sell small. It doesn't make sense in today's environment to do these small little transactional sales where it's going to be low fee, low value, low impact, low respect, low results. Now is when your clients need your transformational level programs. This is where you want to serve them at their highest. And you want to go big. You want to serve big and you want to help them in a profound, deep way. Here's a sound bite I'm going to share with you. You cannot serve big if you sell small. And what Copy is saying here is in the first week of our program, using the tools that she developed, $60,000 plus contract, not a $5,000 speech not a $1,000 coaching package, because you can't serve big if you sell small. That's a tweetable. Right there, that's a tweetable. Tweet that out somewhere. You can't serve big if you sell small. And this is a time where your clients need you to serve big. So don't think that this first sale can, needs to be small. Don't think this first sale needs to be cheap. We've got someone who's in our program right now who's in the process of closing a deal, uh, $15,000 a month ongoing retainer consulting. In this environment, today, end of April 2020, there are companies who are desperate for help, who are cashed up, ready to invest. We'll talk about where that cash is coming from a little bit later on. But we've got one of our clients right now, in addition to some of the other success stories, this one's literally torn from the headlines. I found out about it today. $15,000 a month consulting and retainer contract. She'd never sold anything this big ever before, ever. So what I'm saying to you, my friends, is you can't serve big if you sell small. Please take that to heart. 
Let me show you some uh, evolution, some progression rather, of my own experience building these kinds of programs that I'm about to share with you. This is September 2015. This is straight out of our shopping cart. And uh, we made $57,000 with these high fee mentoring and high fee elite access programs that we're going to talk about. And that was pretty good. That was a good month. That was nice. Uh, October of 2015, 67,000. And then the next one was the milestone. The next one was the breakthrough. The next one was the game changer. November of 2015 was our very first six figure month. And not by a little, by a lot, $147,712. This completely blew my mind. This altered my reality. This was like the matrix. Red pill, blue pill. Pinch me, wake me up. What is going on? What planet am I on that this could possibly be the reality? When I switched into this high fee mentoring and high fee mastermind model that we're going to break down, everything changed. Everything changed financially. Everything changed professionally. This was crazy town. So here's a screenshot from my bank account, August 28th of 2015. This was the very first time that we ever had six figures in the bank account. The bank account was always kind of a hand-to-mouth kind of thing. Maybe we had, you know, $5,000, $6,000, $7,000 in there. The money was coming in so fast and so furious, it was accumulating to the point of having $100,000 in the bank account at, at any given time. And of course, it's gone up from there. But this was, again, I, the reason I took a screenshot from my bank is because I didn't believe it. I didn't take the screenshot for you five years ago. I took the screenshot for me. So when I wake up in the morning and I pinch myself and I go, holy smoke, something's actually working here. Uh, I could look at this and figure out, okay, I'm not dreaming. I'm not hallucinating. These are the kinds of sales that we were bringing in. Remember what I said a moment ago, you can't serve big if you sell small. So we were selling these high fee programs for $12,000 and $9,500. And there's another batch of programs that came in around 6,000 and 5,000 and 5,500. So these are not little transactional sales. These are not, hey, here's 500 bucks, here's 1,000 bucks, here's $47 for an ebook. Or This is major, major high-fee mentoring and mastermind and um, um, mentorship programs that we're talking about here. Uh, $10,000 programs, $12,000 programs, programs that were two payments of six, programs that were three payments of five, uh, big Big sales to solve big problems for people that we knew we could help. Fantastic, amazing clients. All of our clients are fantastic, amazing clients. Otherwise, we don't bring them in. If you're not fantastic and amazing, we're probably not going to do anything together. But this is straight from the shopping cart. This was the direct download from our shopping cart software. This is what comprised those numbers that I just showed you. So here's the question for you. I want you to really marinate on this, cogitate on this. This might be the reason that you're here with me right now. What would your life look like if you were earning 10K per client while working 100% remotely? Put some emotion words into the chat box. Uh, amazing, incredible, uh, out of body experience, uh, fantastic, um, you know, fact over fiction. W what are some emotion words? Relief, joy, uh, celebration. What would your life and business look like if you had the kind of sales that I just showed you, 10, 8, 9, $12,000 per client while never having to show up in an event, never having to show up live, what would that look like in your world? What would that look like in your world? And I'll, I'll read out some of these here real quick. Holy crap, Batman. Happier family, holy cow, freeing, shazam, incredible, wow, amazing, freedom. Neil says orgasmic. Jay also said orgasmic, except Jay was in all caps. Uh, Lois says relief. Ariel says thrilled. Kenneth says time with family. Linda Ann says amazing and gratifying. Fabio says extraordinary. Deborah says lovely. Susan says relief. Riley says worry-free. Um, Alan says bliss. 
Uh, Thomas says amazing with the F word in front of it. Joanna says yummy. Robert says powerful. Lewis says totally different. Totally different. Anita says significant. Colette says nice. Gabriel says amazing. Scott says not too shabby. Michael says reassuring and fantastic. Very, very nice. That is totally possible. And again, I'm still, I'm still pinching myself, frankly. Still pinching myself. This was such a pivotal moment for me, and I know it can be such a pivotal moment for you. So let's continue building this out. This is really about high-fee online programs that are one-to-many, 100% remote, and 100% scalable. Here's the power formula. Here's the ingredient list that we're going to build. Number one is high-fee group mentoring. Second thing are high-fee elite access programs. I don't like the word mastermind. I think the word mastermind has been abused too much, but I call them elite access programs, meaning they have elite access to you. They have elite access to you. And then premium one-on-one -on -one access, but only if you want to do it. So I mentioned that I turned off my one-on-one -on -one private coaching program in 2014. Turned it off for four years, brought it back in 2018 at a much higher price point, did it again in 2019, raised the price again, and I'm still doing it with a very small handful of selected clients. It is crazy expensive. It is the deepest, highest level of work that I can do with somebody, but I'm only doing it because I want to. I don't have to do the one on ones anymore. The lion's share of our revenue is the high-fee group mentoring and the high-fee elite access groups. And we're going to dig into that in a moment. A nice side benefit of doing this is creating an online course that comes from your recordings of number one. So number one, you do 30, 40, 50 minutes of teaching. Then you do a Q&A session with that particular live-led group. When it comes time to electronify or coursify, yes, I'm inventing words right now, electronify and coursify, you can take the recordings of your teaching from your live programs, obviously chop off the Q&A because that's not really relevant, and then you can start to make slides, then you can start to do video, then you can start to be fancier. But the raw material for your online course can come from your raw recordings of your live led group programs. Now, online courses is completely scalable, 100% scalable if it's a do-it-yourself course. Uh, I like building a high-fee group mentoring program around the course because I want to make sure people get results. I'm not, frankly, I'm not going to trust you. I'm not going to trust you to go through any recorded program that I or anyone else creates and get significant transformational results. You will get information for sure. You will get great information. You go through my course, someone else's course, you will get great information. You will, in my world and in my experience, having done this now for seven years since 2013, you will not get transformational results unless I or my team help you. I don't wanna do informational programs anymore. I wanna do transformational programs so every program that we market, every high fee program, you're working with me, you're working with the team, we are holding your feet to the fire, we are making sure that you implement, we make sure that you get on track, stay on track, and shorten the path and accelerate the speed to the results that you signed up for. Because here's the other aha moment, my friends, nobody signs up for a program. No one signs up for a speaker, no one signs up for a coach, no one signs up for a consultant. Everyone is looking to you to deliver outcomes. And we're going to circle back to that concept, so put a push pin in there for a moment as well. Here's Barry Rutten. Barry came through primarily as a coach. He was in our High Fee Mastery program. And here's the story. He was doing one-on-one -on -one coaching for $500 a month. 500 bucks a month. And he says, not liking the model for many reasons. Put on my big boy pants last week. Risked getting an easy $500 a month sale to learn how to make a $7,500 flat fee sale. Uh, he got off the phone quickly. I sent a follow-up email with part uh, with more of the value formula stuff. Got an email today. He's ready to proceed. Maybe this stuff works. 
Thanks for holding my feet to the fire, Sir Newman. By the time our program was done, Barry had sold five of these. He had sold five $7,500 programs. For the math majors in the group, I'll do the math for you. It is $37,500. And he used to be Mr. 500 bucks a month. And he's no longer Mr. 500 bucks a month. Barry actually coaches in the insurance industry. So insurance agents, insurance offices hire him for revenue growth and business development and to hire their team and to do all those great things. Uh, his worth was always way more than $500 a month. And now he's charging $7,500 for a flat fee program. Like I said, by the time we were done, he closed five of these. Uh, unbelievable. Uh, he was pinching himself. I was pinching myself because I was so happy for him, but he was pinching himself because his whole world changed. Kate Delaney came through our program. She says pre-rollout, meaning before the program is even finished, before she even had a program, pre-rollout, I have a full fee mastermind client. I qualified him, sent him what the eight weeks would look like, and he prepaid, freaked that he would miss the window of opportunity. He needs visibility and more confidence in getting media. And of course, that's what Kate does is, is all that great media training. Felt great, meaning the sales process felt great. Newman's a genius. I'm not sure about that, but thank you. The whole concept of a high fee enrollment conversation, feeling great, not feeling pressured, not feeling salesy, not feeling slimy. And the fact that Kate could sell this before the program was even built, because remember, she's not selling the program. She's selling the outcome. She's selling the transformation that her program will create for her clients. This is a central point of doing high fee programs is we have to let go of the inputs and focus on the outputs. How are they transformed when they come out the other side of your program? Now, let's talk about four landmines that you need to avoid. Landmine number one, you start offering low fee online programs. The usual $97, $197, terrible idea. This only attracts a huge tribe of strugglers, wannabes, and what I lovingly call broke-ass losers. Uh, I lovingly call them that for Joanna's benefit, and Joanna's on this masterclass right now. She knows what I'm talking about. You're building the wrong tribe who will never grow your business. My friend Mark Hunter, who's a brilliant sales trainer, one of his favorite sound bites is that you cannot transform a Walmart shopper into a Nordstrom's customer. They either are that high fee client or they're not. Landmine number two is no process or system to your coaching or training, meaning that you haven't shown people visually with a process visual that you actually know what you're doing and you can get them predictable, reliable results. What that results in is way too much convincing, persuading, objection handling, and resistance, that is a yucky, not good feeling sales process. When I say a process visual or a system visual, it looks like something like this. Ours happens to be in columns. This is for our speaker profit formula program. Yours might be a pyramid or four intersecting circles or a four quadrant diagram or whatever makes sense for you. But when we talk about our other program, about our speaker profit formula program, and we say it's built on seven pillars, strategy, packaging, focus, prospects, outreach, sales, and leverage. If everything is working, you got a great business. If anything is missing, you're going to have the symptom or the condition on the right. So without packaging, you're going to be seen as a commodity. If you don't have a solid prospecting plan, you're going to be pinballing all over the map. If you don't like sales, you don't know how to do sales, you will be slowly going broke like I did in the first three years of my business. If you don't have some leverage strategies built into your business model, you're going to experience burnout. You're going to be stressed out, maxed out, burned out. You're going to be on the, the working hours for dollars like I showed you my jam-packed calendar. You're going to be on the gig-to-gig -gig hamster wheel, whatever that looks like for you. When we walk clients through this, and you need to build one of these for yourself, could be columns, pillars, three, you know, three gears that are intersecting, four arrows that connect with each other in some way, show people a physical description or a physical representation 
of the system that you install in their business. And that will build trust and that will build credibility. So if you don't have one of these, build one of these. Really, really important. Landmine number three, too much pull, I'm sorry, too much push, not enough pull, where you spend too much time talking about you and your stuff and you focus on inputs rather than the outcomes. That ends up in your chasing prospects. It's that disappearing prospect syndrome. Instead of having them apply for your program, having them apply for your mentorship, having them apply for your elite access program, having them basically apply to work with you. Landmine number four is having the exact same messaging that you had four months ago. The same messaging as before will come across as tone deaf, not COVID-19 adapted. What's worse is that you now seem ignorant, insensitive, out of touch, and your services are not connected in any way to their most urgent, immediate problems right now. They're just not. So you're seen as irrelevant noise. You are not seen as a high-value, high-trust, relationship-based solution to a problem that they already know they have that will take them to an outcome that they already know they want. If you don't dial this in, it's going to cost you leads, prospects, sales. This is where we have the empty calendar syndrome. This is where uh, you're not going to get, like our client got today, the $15,000 a month retainer-based agreement because she showed up and she was ready to serve big and she was ready to sell big in today's environment, not four months ago. Really important. Type in the word me if you found yourself in any of these four traps. And let me just go back as a reminder, one, two, three, and four. Number one, have you been tempted to do that $47, $197 kind of low, low fee online program? Number two, do you have a solid process visual for your training, coaching, or consulting system? Number three, have you experienced too much pull, too much push, not enough pull, and sales becomes a hard upward slog? And are you suffering because you don't have not yet adapted your messaging? So the same messaging as before is landing on deaf ears. Pop that in the question box. Which one of those, or just type in the word me, if you found yourself doing any of those. I'm going to grab a beverage real quick here, get a little parched. And then we will go to the question box and see what you're see what you're dealing with here. All right. So we have lots of me's. We've got me, 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 landmine one and two, me number three, me oh my, I've gotten better, but it's still a problem. Me, me number one, yes, landmarks, me with lots of E's. This is like an opera. I feel like we're in an opera singing competition with me, 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 lots of me's. Okay, well, we're going to fix that. We're going to fix that. We're going to fix it for you. Because what I want is I want everything in your business, in the current environment, firing on all cylinders. If we dial this in, it's going to be the right offer with the right messaging, connecting with the right people to solve the right problems in the moment that we're in, in the moment that we're in. Here's the stone cold truth, my friends. You can't upsell a broke person. You just can't. The world has changed in permanent and profound ways. And because of that, your services, your programs, and your offers need to adapt. They need to pivot. They need to flex. They need to be reframed. If you build your high fee pyramid that we're going to talk about next and focus 177%, that is a scientific formula. That simply means a lot. If you focus a lot, 177% on folks that you can help to survive in their business, in their company, in their association, in their career, help them pivot, help them win in the new normal, they will talk to you. They will talk to you, they will hire you, they will hire you for premium fees. If you don't do that, that's where all kinds of trouble is going to start. So let's look at the high fee pyramid that you could very well build. First level, base level of the pyramid, 
online course. I mentioned I'm not a big fan of online courses because people don't usually get do-it-yourself results. This is why there's a million diet books in the bookstore and there's a million get-rich-quick financial books also in the bookstore. If all those financial books worked, we'd all be zillionaires. If all those diet books worked, we'd all be tall and uh, thin and have killer abs. Uh, Do-it-yourself typically does not work, but if you want to have some kind of entry-level gateway drug into your world, online course for one, two, or three thousand dollars might do it. Next level up is what we have with our Speaker Profit Formula program. It's that eight-week flagship mentoring program for yours might be five thousand, eight thousand, ten thousand, twelve thousand dollars. Somewhere in that neighborhood is where these programs have a sweet spot. Above that. You can have an inner circle program, sort of first level elite access program. That might be anywhere from 10 to 18,000 a year. And then the top of the pyramid is your big mama program, the elite access program that we talked about, 20,000, 30,000, 40,000 bucks a year. That might be $2,000 a month, $3,000 a month, $4,000 a month. You enroll all kinds of entrepreneurs, executives, peer group people, and that is the top of your pyramid. That is the highest, best, most intensive way that you can serve someone for a one-year or a multi-year program. Now, all of this can be built and coordinated and set up to be in a COVID-19 messaging environment where they might not have looked at this four months ago, but now they're looking at it and they're looking at it as a have-to-have and not as a nice-to-have. Now, looking at the math, you also don't need a lot of clients. I've showed you the export from my shopping cart with the $12,000, $10,000, $9,000, $5,000, $6,000 sales. This is a relationship game. It's not a numbers game. So you don't need high numbers of clients. Let's say that your super duper program is $15,000 and you enroll one person a month. At the end of 12 months, you've got 12 people paying you $15,000 a year. That's $180,000 a year. Let's say you have a $6,000 eight-week mentoring program. Over the course of a year, you get 30 people into that. That's another 180,000. And let's say that you do decide to market and sell an online course. Maybe the course goes for $2,000. Over the course of a year, you get 60 people into that. That's 120. 180 plus 180 plus 120, just those three things with these fairly low numbers, right? Even 60 people in your course, that's five people a month. Five people a month is not a lot. Annually, you're now sitting on a half million dollar business. $480,000, your monthly goal is 40K. Here's the mindset reset I would love you to walk away with. That this might be the real five hour work week. Tim Ferriss talks about the four hour work week. I'm not sure I'm a big fan or a big believer in that, but I've showed you my calendar from 2013 that had the 27 appointments in it. Now I've got three to five standing meetings. Three to five, that is it. So we have our speaker profit formula on Tuesdays and Thursdays. That used to be 4 p.m. Of course, now it's noon. For those of you that are in the program, you know that. Our platinum group would meet on Thursdays. I might do a live lead like a new program uh, on Tuesdays. And then Fridays is uh, sometimes I would do a webinar. Aside from these five bricks in my calendar, I was no longer playing Tetris. I was no longer uh, trapped by my own calendar, by my own business model. And the really cool thing with this is our clients are experiencing the same thing. So John Ramstead came through our program. He says, using your talking points, I just got my first $25,000 this week. Client gave me $5,000 for the last meeting. We'll pay the balance when we start our program next week. John also used to do transactional coaching. Now he sells year long year-long programs for 30k per executive and it's up depending on who you are and kind of where you came to him he's now selling some of his newer programs at 40k per year that includes some other things but literally having for his first first thirty thousand dollar sale ever uh transformational for his business and frankly transformational for his clients because John's a fantastic coach. He's a fantastic speaker. He's a great guy. Uh, he deserves to make that money. And you deserve to make this kind of money. Going back to our mantra again, you can't serve big if you sell small. So John was brave enough to sell big so he could serve big. 
And that's the jackpot. I mean, that is the ultimate jackpot of when you start to dial this in, you serve better clients, bigger clients for bigger fees. You can start to raise the fee and start to decrease the number of people you serve so that you can give them more love, more time, more attention, and more results. I want you to think about this also. It can actually be easier and less stressful and way more fun to generate $40,000 a month than to generate $4,000 a month. The magic key is you have to plan out the math. So let's think about the business model that you really want to build. Door number one, keynotes, seminars, workshops, live events. Door number two, in-person consulting, training, uh, strategic work sessions, whiteboard sessions, retreats, events. Those two doors are closed right now. Even when they reopen, and they will reopen, they will reopen, things will reopen. They're not going to reopen the same. They're going to reopen different. They're going to come back different. But door number three is this high fee model with quick profitability, lets you generate cash, gives you an exclusive elite offering, 100% remote delivery with a COVID-19 adapted value prop that will pierce through the noise, will get you attention, will get you conversations, and will get you clients because you are now relevant to their world and their biggest hair on fire challenges. Having laid all of that out, I want you to be brutally honest with me. Scale of one to 10, one is not excited at all. Newman, I don't get it. I don't like it. I don't want to do this. 10 is, oh my gosh, I am, I'm a convert. This is awesome. This is where I got to take my business. What's going on with you? How excited are you right now? Scale of one to 10 and be honest, you know, seven's okay. Sixes, fives, threes, ones, whatever it is. Don't, don't lie to me. Don't try and make me feel good. But I'd love to find out, based on everything we shared, based on the experience and expertise that you're bringing to the table, how excited are you about pivoting and shifting to this new model? And let's see what some people are saying here. One to 10. One is forget about it. Like we say here in Philly, forget about it. 10 is OMG, put me in coach. This is my future. All right, so Robert's an eight, Linda Ann is a 10, Don is a six, fair enough, Steven's a seven or an eight, Neil's a seven, a whole bunch of nines, tens, so Cooksey is in at nine, eight, Jess is 11, John is 8.93, uh, Nancy's nine, Michael's 10, yes, 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 great, put me in coach, yes, 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 9.5, more nines, uh, another six, okay, I got it, I got it. Um, so we have some excited people, some people are like, yeah, uh, not many people in the low numbers though. So it's either a little bit of self-doubt. I'm seeing difficult in my industry, not sure how it works B2B. We can answer all of those during the Q and A hang out, stick around. We, we'll get to all of that in the Q and A, but quite a few excited people with lots of exclamation points and quite a few decimal places going out. Even better news is you can start right now. Live-led group mentoring is very easy to start. You can monetize, create your program, test and validate your program, refine it as you go. When, my, when I first launched my first group program in 2009, I know you'll find this hard to believe, it was not perfect. It was not perfect. It is a far cry from what it is today. Today's iteration of it is the speaker profit formula. When I started doing it in 2009, it was called the Speaker Marketing Toolkit. And it was primitive. It was primitive. It was Yahoo Groups. It was teleseminar based because that was before Zoom. 2009 was pre-Zoom, believe it or not. Uh, Zoom, by the way, in case you're curious, fun facts, and Zoom is getting so much attention these days. Zoom was founded in 2011, the company. So if you see someone or hear someone going, oh, yeah, I was on Zoom since 2005. Well, they're lying because they were, nobody was on Zoom since 2005. Company was founded in 2011. So <laughs> don't, don't listen to the blowhards out there. I've been on Zoom for 20 years. No, you haven't. Nobody has. Nobody has. But it was primitive. Here's what I mean by figure it out on the way. This is same day sales, February 27th, 2014. I put an offer out and $10,535. 
Later on, November of 2014, again, all of these are same day sales, 13,877. I was floating an idea. I was figuring some things out. I was beta testing. There's another one from 2016, 16,317. Another sales day, February 25th, 2015, 20,226. Imagine getting paid these kind of numbers to figure it out. You're getting paid these kind of numbers literally to figure it out. Type in the word yes with a dollar sign if you would like to get paydays like these while you're beta testing, while you're validating, while you're figuring some things out. Because this is an iterative process where your program gets better the more you refine it, the more you tweak it, the more you tune it. But people are going to want to get in on the transformation even if your program is imperfect. And I'm seeing lots and lots and lots of yeses with lots of dollar signs, exclamation points, another F-bomb. Fantastic. Thank you. We got to keep it clean up here, people. Keep it clean. Come on. I, I, I know you're excited, but still keep it clean. All right. Let's talk about building out your flagship program. My best advice is to work backwards. While you're thinking about that, let me take another drink. Very tasty. Work backwards means I want you to build the marketing first. Build the marketing first and use the following building block formula. Make the language client-centric, not program-centric and not you-centric. And put into your program exactly what your prospects want, need, and are looking for help with right now. Building block number one is that eight to 10 week transformational mentoring program. That can be structured as follows. One to two calls per week. When I started out doing the live led group programs, it was once a week. Now, as you know, from speaker profit formula, some people know. Uh, that is twice a week. We just decided to do two calls per week. It's totally optional. People do this a variety of ways. You can do one week can be a strategy training call. The next week can be an action or accountability call. If you do two calls a week or do a bonus call once in a while, that's always welcome. Things like coaching clinics, things like office hours, drop in. You can just help your clients with some laser coaching if you want to. And that's your flagship front end program. It lasts between eight and 10 weeks. It is a $5,000 to $10,000 program. It could be 12, it could be more, but you know, somewhere between five, eight, nine, 10, 12, that's the ballpark where these programs are sold. If you're selling this to an executive group, you can do what I call stair step pricing, meaning the first two people come in at 10, the next two people come in at nine, the next two people come in at eight. So the more people that they send, the cheaper the program gets but you're not getting ripped off by doing some kind of group price or you know, uh, lowballing your fee. You can do stair-step pricing when you sell this to companies. Building block number two is that high fee elite access program. Year long, multi-year, eventually you want people to stick with you year after year and continually renew. Virtual monthly meetings, coaching clinics via Zoom, you can do two to three virtual summits. We used to do live events, of course, live summits, but now we're in the world of COVID, so it's virtual summits, full day, two day, three day things, 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. You take some breaks in between, you do some homework, you do some online networking, those are fun. And then that is your annual program that you can sell, you know, 2K a month, 20K for the year, 4K a month, 40K for the year. I like that pricing formula. You prepay in advance, you basically get two months free. If your program is 20 or 30 or 40, it's 2K per month or 3K per month or 4K per month. Hey, you want to save 8,000 bucks? Let's do 40K up front. You want to save 6,000 bucks? Let's do 30K up front instead of 3,000 a month. So you can, uh, these are sold on an annual agreement, but you can have a payment plan if you want a payment plan. That makes it easier to digest, easier to budget for. Building block number three is recorded modules if you want to put those in later. And this is what I said about Electronify and Courseify. This is where you add some video assets or audio or text or just keep it super simple. 
Do not make it flashy. Do not make it fancy. You can add all this jazz later if you want to. Some people put in the videos and they strip out the audio so people can like, you know, go jogging with the dog. They do transcripts. You don't have to do all of that. At the beginning, my best advice is to keep it super simple. You can electronify and coarsify it later. Now, let's talk about filling your program. Filling your program is 10 times easier than you think. You literally need one PDF, one Google Doc, one piece of paper. You need an application process that has some key questions that will filter and sort the right kinds of people into your program and filter and sort the wrong kinds of people out. A flipped phone script, so they're applying for you as much as you're applying for them, right? You're not selling or pitching your program. You are admitting them, like to a prestigious college or university, Harvard, Stanford, Yale, right? Flipped phone script to qualify them as much as they're qualifying you. And then, of course, you have your structure and your process and your system to your coaching and to your mentoring so that they know what they're getting and you've got a predictable, reliable way to get them the results that you're promising. Now, John Barb came through one of our programs early, early on, back when it was in the primitive phase. Even in the primitive phase, this was teleseminar. I mentioned we used Yahoo groups because Facebook wasn't a big deal uh, in 2009. At least it wasn't a big deal outside the college campus environment. So he came through our minimum viable product, Stone Age, prehistoric by today's standards. And here's what he said about that experience. David's program went so far above and beyond my wildest expectations. Incredibly valuable in every single class, every single time. Clear, simple, actionable. Just one money-making idea after money-making idea. I couldn't be happier with my investment in David's program. Why do I show this to you? I am going to bet in all humility that you don't have testimonials like this from your live-led programs. You don't have testimonials like this from an eight-hour training workshop. You don't have testimonials like this from a in-person consulting. And I was doing this primitive, bare bones, minimal technology, everything I just talked about, keep it super simple. When I look back on the tech and the tools that we used when John came through the program, this was prehistoric. Was I selling the program? No. Was I selling the technology and how fancy it was? No. Was I selling the glitz and the glamour? No. Was I hell-bent on his outcomes? I was. You do not need a big, fancy, electronified, coursified program to deliver amazing, incredible, transformational results. So I'm showing you this testimonial because I want your clients and your prospects to, to say, oh my God, I came through Don's program. I came through Jane's program. It was totally transformational. It totally changed my career, totally changed my business, totally changed my life. I've told 10 of my friends, and you're keeping it super simple, super low tech. It is easy to deliver. You are focused 100% on client outcomes, not on fancy jazz that's not going to move the needle on their success. So that's the aspiration. Now, I mentioned about the real five-hour work week. I want you to think about this. Let's say your mastermind program, your elite access program is 20,000 bucks. You meet with those people in this time slot, Thursdays at two o'clock. There might be five people on that Zoom call. Now you have $100,000, you're spending an hour a week. Could be 10 people, $200,000, same hour. Three, 300K with 15 people in that program, same hour. Same hour. Maybe the call goes 90 minutes if there's a whole lot of people. They've got more questions. They've got more roundtable issues. They've got more processing. Now let's talk about your front-end program. Let's say you have a $6,000 program. You sign up your first five people. You spend two hours with those people. I'm giving you an extra hour here. Two hours with those people, five of them in the program, thir the 30,000. 10, 60,000. Time doesn't change. 15, 90,000. Time doesn't change. Here's the aha moment. Your time, attention, and presence is the same. And the more people that you enroll and the more people that you serve at a time, the richer the experience is for them because now they've got a bigger cohort of people to network with and connect with and, and get ideas from. 
and your time commitment remains the same. That's the key to scalability. Here are the numbers, and these are five-year numbers on the top row, and they're 2019 numbers on the bottom row. And again, I completely am in touch with how privileged and amazing and fantastic and lucky um, I am to be sharing these, these numbers with you. When you start, it's going to be baby steps, but here's where it could end up. We've had 435 people come through our various mentoring programs, speaker profit formula, high fee mastery, high fee webinars, keynotes that convert, all those different programs. Again, these are not annual. These are over five years. 41 people in our mastermind programs, including the 11 fantastic people in our Platinum Council right now, several of whom are on this call. 203 people that came through a live-led course like John Barb, for example, between 1977 and 4977. 2019, excited or not, six figures in taxes. What I am very excited about is our donations, topped $75,000. I wanted to get that to 100. I think this year we'll make it 100. Ultimately, I'd like to make that a million. My personal goal, my one of my lifetime goals is to be able to give away $1 million per year it, to help charitable causes and to make donations for organizations that make a difference in the world. And then 2019, we're also able to squirrel away the maximum permitted for our SEP IRA. Now, this is over five years, right? It's not an overnight thing. I'm not saying you snap your fingers and you make it happen. But if you want to have significance in the world, if you want to have the impact that you want to have, and the freedom and the lifestyle and the choices that you want, this business model that I've been doing for the last seven years and been really, really successful with for the last five years, this is probably your fastest path to doing this. Without burning yourself out, putting on zillions of air miles and being subject to who knows what, uh, global pandemics and acts of terrorism and all kinds of craziness. So this is, this is the path, this is the, the numbers that uh, we were able to put on the scoreboard. So the question, once again, is what would your life and business look like if your main services were 100% scalable, just like I showed you loading up the calendar, more and more people, helping more and more people, impacting more and more people, but your time commitment does not change. Everything is 100% remote. And you've got the post-COVID-19 hyper-relevant messaging. What would that feel like? What would that feel like? What would that look like if everything in your business was 100% scalable, 100% remote, and post-COVID-19 hyper-relevant, meaning people wanted to talk to you now more than they did four months ago, more than they did last year? more than they did perhaps ever before in your career, and you had something amazing, incredible, and super valuable to help them. Uh, hyper elegant, quite comfortable, better and much simpler, awesome, fantastic, lots and lots and lots of dollar signs there. Yeah, exactly. You got it. You got it. Well, let me go back. Uh, I just popped a little accidental slide in there. Uh, caveat Vendator means seller beware. We're familiar with caveat emptor. That means buyer beware. You as a seller, you can sell your time, but you can never buy it back. And the kinds of clients that you choose to work with will impact how successful you are, how much money you make, and what significance you're able to achieve in the world. Now, to do that, there's all kinds of crap that you do not need, by the way. Massive list building, which is hard, spending a fortune on ads, super fancy sales pages, endless videos, webinars, and email blasts, time-sucking launch nonsense, none of that. This is about reaching out to help a small select group. And here's why this makes sense. There is no need for immediate list building. You can generate cash quickly in the new normal. You'll get amazing results-focused testimonials and case studies. Fine-tune and sharpen the value prop as you go, but get paid now. And I showed you those iterative uh, paydays that we've gotten along the way, 5K, 10K, 15K, 16K, 20K. You can build it small and then scale it up later as a proven expert with authority and amazing case study testimonials and a track record of success. 
I'm not sure exactly why you showed up here today. It could be that you're just tired of hearing, oh, you should do coaching. You should have an online course. You should do online programs. You should do more virtual training, but you just don't know where to begin. Maybe you want to protect your cash flow, revamp your business for online and remote delivery, and start charging premium fees for premium value, whether that's online or offline. Or like me, deep down, you know that offering high fee virtual programs is the key to help you survive, pivot your revenue model, and thrive long term. If there's one thing to take away from today, it's that I've cracked the code on how to create, market, and fill remote programs with great people just like you. And it changed my world. It changed my income. It totally changed the level of impact that I'm able to have with my prospects and clients. I've showed you that we went from $100,000 years to $100,000 months. And it is very much a replicable system and process that you can make happen in the next 60 days. So at this point, you've got a decision, my friends. Information typically is not going to cut it, which is why a lot of these do-it-yourself programs don't work. You need a system and accountability and mentoring. And at this point, you've got a choice. Life is, of course, always about choices. You can do it slowly using trial and error and some of what I taught you today, or you can do it quickly and apply for my High Fee Mastery 8-Week Mentorship Program. I'm going to spend a little bit of time talking about that. Then we're going to circle into our Q&A, and I will stick around for as long as it takes to answer any and all of your questions about any of today's teaching, how to pivot your business model, how to flex your messaging into the COVID-19 universe. But let me invite you to consider this, because I think it'll be massively helpful to you. Our High Fee Mastery Program is going to help you design, package, and validate your idea. We're going to help you build those super simple weekly modules I told you about, create your flagship high fee mentoring program that you'll be able to offer for five to $10,000 per person, create your high fee platinum style program or elite access program that you'll be able to offer for fifteen to $25,000 per person and give you every template, every tool, every script that you need the PDFs, what the web page looks like, what the surveys look like, what the application materials look like. You're getting everything end to end. We're going to help you make your first remote program sales. We're going to review your post COVID-19 value proposition and offers. We're going to help you create that customized flipped phone script that I told you about to help you close more clients. We're going to give you live ammo feedback on your actual calls. We're going to have hot seats, we're going to have role plays. You can send me your sales call recordings, and I will do a live teardown or breakdown of where you could have done better and said some things differently using our system and our scripts. Detailed enrollment conversation coaching to make sure that you get more yeses than nos. So we're going to include everything with this. You're going to get the high fee mentoring workshop to design your eight week program, the high fee mastermind workshop to uh, design and launch your high fee elite access group and the high fee selling workshop with sales mindset, tool set, scripting, and live feedback. Think about it this way. In order for you to be successful, with, there's an entire spectrum from information to inspiration to recommendation. That's not where the money is. The money is in implementation and outcomes. And High Fee Mastery is 100% squarely focused on implementation and outcomes. There's a relentless focus on results. There's going to be a Facebook group that's open 24-7. I'm going to be in there chiming in, reviewing your material, giving you feedback. Weekly web conference. Personal never stuck email access to me. So if you're ever stuck on anything, you want my eyeballs on something, you want me to chime in, you want me to look at something that you're working on, peek over your shoulder give you advice, feedback, edits, et cetera, that's included. If you do the work, you will have multiple high-fee remote programs packaged, positioned, in place, and ready to sell even before we're done with the program. I talked about Barry Rutten. Barry built his $7,500 program. By the time he was done, he sold five of them before our program was even over. He made five $7,500 sales before the program was even done. So again, you're getting the front-end program design, the back-end program design, 
the sales mindset, tool set, scripting, hot seats, live ammo feedback, and eight weeks working with me personally on the weekly calls, step-by-step -step action planning, never stuck email support, that all taken together would be $10,991, even if we kept it there and we're not keeping it there. If you can close one new client for 10K, this program would have sold itself, would have paid for itself. But like I said, we're not doing 10,991 because I wanna help as many people as possible. So here's what we're doing. For a very limited time, this is 36.97. I was gonna make it 5K, we're not even doing 5K. It's 36.97, a payment plan is available, and the place to apply is highfeemastery.com. Now, I mentioned that there's a payment plan available. There's also an alumni discount. So if you're coming out of Speaker Profit Formula, if you're coming out of one of our other programs and you're already in the family, you are gonna pay less than $36.97. We can talk about that during your decision call. So when you go to highfeemastery.com, there's an application because guess what? I am walking my talk. And there's a great quote right here. You should feel equally proud of what you sell as to who you sell it to. And we don't take everyone in this program. Uh, you need to apply because I am modeling the steps for you. If we said, oh no, click here, buy now, you know, go, go right now, buy now, buy now, buy now, buy now, we would get every Tom, Dick, Harry, and Jane in the program. And I can't help every Tom, Dick, Harry, and Jane. I can help a serious business owner, a serious consultant, a serious speaker, a serious coach, a serious trainer, a serious professional mentor, take their offline business online, but I need to make sure that you're a fit for me, just like you need to make sure I'm a fit for you. So there is an application process. When you go to highfeemastery.com, you can open up that tab, get ready to do the application while we're rolling into our Q&A here. But this is an application curated program that we do not let everyone in. You need to go through me. You need to go through me. Here's the other reason that I want to make sure you're successful in this program. If I don't have a strong sense that you'll be successful in the program, I am not going to let you in. And I'm going to tell you why in a moment. Charles Scott actually came through High Fee Mastery. He had an amazing, fantastic success. No funnels, no launches, no videos, no webinar, no email list. Charles had nothing, nothing. He says, David, I made $54,000 in the past month from the executive mentoring program I created. Remarkable what can happen when you set an ambitious goal. He says, thank you for providing the tools, framework, and motivation for me to create an executive mentoring program that exceeded my most ambitious financial goals. So you can do this very, very quickly. Charles did, let me go back there. Charles did $54,000 in 30 days with no email list, going to existing relationships, existing people he was already talking to, and he sold this program that didn't exist prior to him working with us to the tune of $54,000 in the first month. And he's done more and better and bigger since then. So this can be an amazing transformation in your business much, much quicker than you might even think. So I would encourage you, go to highfeemastery.com. It all starts with an application and a conversation with me. I've opened up my calendar thoroughly and completely for tomorrow and the next day. So you're talking to me, there's no minions, there's no team, there's nobody else doing this. This is you and me, mano a mano. There's going to be a questionnaire that I'll show you here in a moment. Uh, please be as complete as you possibly can. The more detail you put in the questionnaire, the more value and the more insight we'll be able to get from our decision call to see if this program really is a great fit for you. Two guarantees so you can sleep at night. Guarantee number one is I want you to try it for 30 days. So it's an eight week program. 30 days is four weeks in case you're keeping track of the math. I want you to try 
of the program, full 50%. Marinate in it, use it, do the exercises, get the coaching, get the feedback from me. If for any reason you don't love us, you don't love me, I'm wearing funny glasses one day, you don't like my sweater, you let me know within 30 days and we will give you 100% of your investment back, 100%. So I'm going to encourage you once again, apply, open this tab, highfeemastery.com, get that application open, do the application while we're talking before we get to the Q&A. But that's guarantee number one. That is a program guarantee that you need to love it. You need to love it. Embrace it, hug it, kiss it, buy it flowers, buy it dinner. Guarantee number two is a results guarantee that you will earn at least $10,000 through your new high fee mentoring programs, or we will work with you until you do. So I've shown you some big numbers, some big student success, some big client success. We're only going to let you in if I have a high degree of confidence that you can do that too. But you have to be honest with me on the questionnaire. You have to be honest with me that you've got your stuff dialed in. And if you don't, it's not going to work. And if you do, I will stick with you until the bitter end. So you have two pretty much bulletproof guarantees where 100% of the risk is on me. Now I'm going to throw in one or two more things because you're on this webinar with me. Bonus number one, people might say, oh my gosh, I've been doing this for 20 years. I'm you know, speaker, coach, trainer. I've never done anything online. I have no idea where to begin one-on-one -on -one kickoff call with me personally. That's a thousand dollar value for the first five folks who apply at highfeemastery.com and then join the program. So the first five people that we have the decision call, we accept you into the program, one, two, three, four, five, we're gonna have these one-on-ones. We're gonna have these one-on-ones where you're, you and I will set the game plan, we will set the path and the plan, to make sure that you're successful. So to review, it's gonna be the high fee mentoring program that you build with my help. We're gonna help you design and launch your elite access group. We're gonna do the sales mindset, tool set, scripting, hot seats, live feedback, and role plays. You're gonna get the eight weeks working with me directly and personally. You're gonna get the kickoff call with personalized guidance, a specific strategy to get you from where you are to where you want to be and exactly tailored help. That brings it to 11,991. We mentioned this before. You're not doing 11,991. You're doing 3697. There are payment plans available to spread out that 3697. There's also an alumni discount for folks that have worked with us before. You will pay less than the folks coming in off the street. Uh, so your number will be less than $36.97. Second bonus is, well, David, I, I have no idea what my market wants, what my market needs, how this whole crazy upside down, shaken and stirred world now affects my topic and my messaging and what I need to say and what I need to do to get their attention. So we're going to do a COVID-19 value prop pivot and now more than ever messaging masterclass. That's a $497 value. That is if you apply right now. During this webinar, I've got one or two more minutes of stuff here. Then we're gonna pop right into Q&A, do a deep dive Q&A, answer all of your questions. But if you apply, open up that tab, do the questionnaire, get on the calendar, show you how that works in a moment. I'm gonna give you the COVID-19 value prop pivoting and now more than ever messaging masterclass to help you reframe the context around your content. So taken all together, you're getting the front end of program development, the elite access program development, the sales workshop, the accountability program working with me, the one-on-one -on -one kickoff call to get you off to a strong start, and the COVID-19 now more than ever offers, now more than ever messaging to make sure that you are highly relevant 12,488, that's now the final number. There's no room on the slide. I, I couldn't put more on here if I wanted to. Not 12,488, 3697. Alumni pay a little bit less. Installment plan for everybody 
If you want to stretch things out, make it nice and comfortable, extend this over the next three months, let's say, we can talk about that on our decision call. Bob Leffler came through one of our programs. He says, I was doing a business model for my coaching, which was working pretty great. Then I signed up for your course, and today was a typical day. I just got off the phone with a guy who gave me $2,000 of his money because I did exactly what you told me to do. So almost every day that happens to me now. So if anyone's thinking about not doing this, you'd be insane. You've got to not only do it, but you've got to implement everything David teaches and you will be successful. And that's Bob Leffler from Fearless Agent. So right now that link is open. Apply at highfeemastery.com. Step one is you'll go to a questionnaire that looks like this. HighFeeMastery.com is going to open up this window. You are going to click that big red button that says click here to start. You're going to answer some questions as thoroughly and as detailed as you possibly can. You're going to go to my calendar next. That's going to take you automatically to my calendar. You're going to pick an open day and an open time today, tomorrow, as long as those appointments are available. When you go to HighFeeMastery.com, I want you to schedule this, put your name and contact details, but this is my personal calendar that I use for everything. So I've got private clients coming on here. I've got all kinds of people. I would appreciate if you put in the notes field, high fee mastery. So I know that this is a decision call where you and I will talk about the program, make sure you're a great fit, make sure you're equipped and ready to rock and roll and have some success with it. So that would just help me out. So if I see high fee mastery in the notes field, then you click on the big blue button that says done. And then we are talking. So you get to decide what happens tomorrow. Um, you know, you can go back to the old way, the struggle, door number one, door number two. Oh my gosh, my calendar's wiped clean. I've got tone deaf messaging. No one's taken my call. I can't do any door opening relationships. All my existing clients and prospects, their hair is on fire. They're totally distracted. They don't want leadership anymore. They don't want sales. They don't want customer service. They don't want innovation or strategy or team building or project management. And they don't, at least not the old way that you've been talking about it. So let's get you the new way that is 100% remote, 100% virtual, 100% scalable, and will make you more revenue as you increase your impact and you help more people to get through this crazy global crisis. So I would encourage you, apply right now at High Fee Mastery. You're about to kick into the Q&A. Next 48 hours is what I've opened on my calendar. Single payment of $36.97. I mentioned that there's an installment plan. Payment plans are available. Alumni pay less. Get a kickoff call with me for the first five folks. Fill out that questionnaire at highfeemastery.com. Be as complete and detailed as possible, please, on that questionnaire. If you're not sure, if you're on the fence, oh my gosh, I don't know, I'm not sure. We have the two guarantees, right? Program guarantee that you try it for 30 days. Any reason you don't love it, you get 100% of your money back. You are made completely whole financially. Uh, and then the result guarantee that we will work with you until you generate $10,000 in your own high fee mentoring and mastermind programs. If you're still on the fence, if you're not sure, tell you what, book the call, do the questionnaire, you and I will hop on the phone and we will figure it out together. And like I said, I will not invite you in if I don't feel that you've got a strong chance of success. I will not invite you in. Because why, why should I? You'll come in, you'll splash around in the program, you might not do a whole lot of the work, it's gonna be very frustrating for you, and you'll end up bailing out of the program anyway. You're fine, but I'm out, my time, my money, my bandwidth, so there's a financial incentive for me not to let you in if I don't feel you will be very successful in the program. And I designed it that way so that all the risk is on me. All the risk is on me. So if you landed only one 10K remote client, if you never had to show up or be dependent on live events for your main income, uh, 
that would be an amazing, incredible pivot and flex in your business. You never had to show up or be dependent on live events unless you wanted to, unless you wanted to. And when things come back, because like I said, they will come back, they'll just come back different. They won't come back the same. You will now have a permanent capability and competency in your business to do offline programs, online programs, or hybrid programs that take the best of both. But if you're in an offline business and we're in an online world, the lifespan of your business is going to be shorter than it should be. So I would encourage you, let's book a call at highfeemastery.com. Let's figure this out together. If I can help you, I would love to help you with 100% of the risk being on my side of the table. Now, if you're still here, even though we're about to pop into our Q&A, if you're still here, there's nothing but excuses left. So I've made this completely safe. I tried to work really hard to make this a no-brainer. If you're thinking the program doesn't work, I showed you example after example after example after example that the program works if you do the work. And I also mentioned it's amazing the results you do not get from the work you do not do. So the program works if you do. I can't afford it? Holy smokes, are you kidding? You can't afford not to do it. With the COVID-19 messaging, online virtual delivery platform, the fees that might be higher fees than you're getting in the offline world and completely scalable so that you have the freedom and the impact and the lifestyle that you want, I would argue that you can't afford not to look at this. And then finally, it won't work for me. I just finished telling you, we're going to have a decision call together. If it won't work for you, I'm not going to let you in. Why should I? I'm not getting a client. I'm not getting the money. I'm not getting a success story. I'm not going to let you in. So because of the results guarantee, because of the program guarantee, it won't work for me is also off the table. So all three of those excuses go boom, 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 goodbye. You're going right now to highfeemastery.com. Do the questionnaire. Let's hop on a decision call. Figure this out tomorrow. Figure this out the next day if tomorrow's schedule is already filling up. And one last time, the hit parade before we get to our Q&A, you're getting the high fee mentoring. We're going to help you design and launch your eight-week program. The high fee elite access group we're going to help you with. The high fee sales and selling workshop with sales mindset, tool set, scripting, hot seats, role plays, live ammo feedback on your enrollment conversations, the eight weeks working personally with me with the never stuck email support, the bonus one-on-one -on -one kickoff call for the first five people who apply and are accepted, the COVID-19 value prop development, now more than ever, messaging and offers workshop, 12,488, that's not your number. Your number is 36, 97, installment plans available, Alumni discount is in effect. That's what we're doing. So at this point, let's do our Q&A while you're popping over to highfeemastery.com. Open that tab, get into the questions. They're fairly straightforward. Get a time today, tomorrow. Until those appointments are gone, they are yours at highfeemastery.com. And let's put some questions in the question box. What can I answer for you about high fee mentoring programs, high fee elite access programs, pivoting and flexing your topic, uh, pivoting and flexing your COVID-19 messaging that we talked about with your new nouns and your new verbs, uh, connecting with premium clients who are waiting and expecting to pay premium fees for the exact help that they need right now. Because my friends, our clients and our prospects just got a whole world of new problems. So solve bigger problems, get bigger checks. That's what these programs are designed to do. Solve bigger problems, get bigger checks. While you're popping the questions in the question box, I'm going to get a drink because, again, I'm a little bit parched from all this talking. But we're just going to march down all your questions one at a time, pop them in the question box, and we will get busy here in about 10 seconds.
All right, let's have a look here. Wow, whoo, lots of stuff flying by here. So we get pot past the yeses, and question, question, question. All right. Where am I going here? Cooksey says, I love, I love this model. I love this model and the financial impact of it. I'm not sure I want 100% virtual. Uh, and here's how to do both. Okay, yes, well, you can totally do both. That, and that, again, that's the point. So I decided in 2013 to move my business 100% online. I still do offline events, private seminars, private events, private summits for our clients. And of course, I speak at you know, other events, um, some paid, some for lead generation. But that's when I want to. That's when I want to, Scott. So I love what you're saying. You do not have to move 100% virtual, uh, but you have the option, and this installs that permanent capability and competency in your business that you can flex more online, you can flex more offline, or you can create some new hybrid models if you want to. All right, let's see. Rob Bell, fantastic. Rob Bell says, I am in. So great to see you on the calendar. Very, very nice. Um, John O'Grady says, how is this different from the SPF course? Great question. So our, our Speaker Profit Formula program is a high fee mentoring program. And that is about uh, positioning, packaging, messaging, uh, speaking, coaching, consulting, all kinds of things. We have a little bit of some bonus content in module nine uh, around this topic, but this, John, is 100%. This is the ultimate deep dive into taking your business online. Uh, that is all that we're talking about. So I'm not going to go back to the list of crazy ingredients, but it's how to build the program, how to market the program, how to sell the program, how to position the program, how to enroll people in the program, how to upsell and cross-sell people who have come through your other coaching, consulting, training, speaking, workshops, etc. So you saw Charles Scott and his success story. He was already out speaking. He already had some things dialed in. He wanted to move to an online model in addition to his speaking. He was a Vistage speaker, actually, Charles is, speaking to small groups, 10, 12, 15 CEOs a few times a month. And within 30 days, he was take that existing business, add the high fee mentoring component to it, and that's what brought in the $54,000 of additional revenue. So we are focused 100% on the high fee eight-week program, building it, marketing it, selling it, filling it, the elite access year-long or multi-year program, building it, creating it, selling it, and rolling people, upgrading people into it, and then the third piece, John, is the high fee one-on-one, -on -one. the high fee one-on-one -on -one executive coaching, executive mentoring, executive consulting that you may want to add to your mix as well. So great job. All right. Shelly says, just booked a call with you. Awesome. Really, really good. Uh, John, I'm hoping I answered your question about the difference. And we've got people that are doing both. We've got high fee mastery program that then later on do speaker profit formula. And we have some speaker profit formula grads that come into high fee mastery. Uh, Matt Coyne says, I am in talk tomorrow. Totally fantastic. Matt's a great example of he is in SPF right now. I think he's graduating in a week or two. And uh, Matt is about to jump into the high fee mastery program. Wonderful. Stephen Ross applied. Call set up for tomorrow. Talk to you then. Tremendous. Now, let's see. Thomas. The content for all the programs we create during the program, is that our original content? Is it something that you help develop? So yes and yes. Uh, it, here's the beauty of this. And this is why Barry Rutten had immediate success. Kate Delaney had immediate success. All these people that I showed you had immediate success because it was based on content that they already had in some other delivery mode. So it was based on their keynotes. It was based on their training. It was based on their coaching methodology. It was based on their consulting process. You shouldn't have to create anything from scratch. 
In fact, if you are creating new intellectual property from scratch for your high fee mentoring programs, you're probably doing it wrong because now you're leaving your area of genius, you're leaving your area of expertise, and you're trying to stretch into something that it's not. So this is about repurposing, reframing, recycling, and re-messaging things that your clients already need help with and being a solution to problems that you're already brilliant at solving. So Thomas, fantastic question. You should not have to re, uh, I'm sorry, you should not have to create anything new. This is a recreation and reframing process. Second part of your question, when I said yes and yes, is of course we help you with that reframing and restructuring process. Um, so that is totally something that you and I can work on. We can bring that up on one of the mentoring calls. We can screen share that. We can chip away at it together. But the other thing, Thomas, that you're going to do is the vetting and validation step. The vetting and validation step makes sure that this is not just a program that you want to sell, but it's a program that your prospects want to buy. So we're definitely, we're, this is called guest free program development. We're not guessing, we're not hoping, we're not winging it. There is definitely a vetting and validation step, Thomas, that we're going to go through together. And that's going to help you fine tune the content that you put in the program because you're going to be asking yourself, here's some content. Does it deserve a spot, right? Does it deserve a spot in my eight week program? Is it important enough? Is it central enough? Is it vital enough? And I will help you benchmark that. And so will your survey and so will your prospects. Thomas, you have another question. How do we find these clients? Is that part of the program? Yes. And the short answer is organic outreach. Organic outreach to people that you feel have a high probability of needing and wanting what you do. Needing and wanting what you do. So what does that mean? That means we do some intelligent prospecting. That means that it might be strategic introductions or referrals. That means it might be we go to some blogs, portals, communities, and groups where these people are already gathering and talking about the kinds of problems that you solve and then doing organic outreach, inviting them to a conversation about how you can help them. That's how I look at prospecting, is organic outreach and organic prospecting is reaching out in a high-touch, high-sensitivity way and inviting people to a conversation about how you can help them. How you can help them. Great questions. Colleen says, you mentioned the client who didn't have any prospects in his funnel. How did he find his first high fee clients doesn't add up? So it's not a funnel. He already had existing relationships, right? But he did know he didn't have an email list. He didn't do any kind of online craziness. He didn't do a big list building campaign, webinars, videos, nothing. He used organic outreach to people he already knew and to people that he did not yet know. So the organic outreach is client by client, one at a time, right? High value, low volume, meaning you don't need a lot of them. High value, low volume, high relationship outreach. Another name for that might be trusted advisor outreach, that you're not pushing, you're not peddling, you're not pitching or selling, but you're truly inviting people to a conversation about how you can help them. Some of those people you already have. Some of those people are already in your network. You might have already spoken to them, coached them, consulted with them. They might be prospects who bought, prospects who didn't buy. It could be an email list, no matter how small. It could be no email list. It could just be organic people in your network. And like I said, strategic introductions, referrals, connections on LinkedIn, intelligent prospecting to reach out to people that you have a high degree of confidence you can help. That is the deal. And John O'Grady says, yes, thank you. Awesome. Uh, Pam says, I'm a health and safety consultant. I've never seen high fee programs in this area. I'm not sure how to frame it. Well, Pam, I have great news. I could talk to you about making money. I could talk to you about saving money. I could talk to you about losing weight, being taller, being thinner, having more hair. If you are a safety consultant, you're literally talking about saving lives. You're talking about people not am amputating a leg. 
You're talking about people not losing an arm. You're talking about companies not being subject to multi-million dollar lawsuits and the PR disaster of their nightmares. So that urgency is even higher in your world. OSHA, safety, uh, equipment safety, all kinds of crazy things. You are literally in the business of saving lives and saving reputations, saving individual employees' lives and saving corporate reputations. They don't want to be on the front page of USA Today with the story about decapitations and factories uh, you know, being, uh, being, uh, you know, b uh, who knows what OSHA violations and chicken coops going crazy. And, you know, we've seen these stories. We've seen these stories on the front page of the wall street journal, New York times, USA today, your clients don't want to be the front page story tomorrow morning. So anything and everything that you can do in that health and safety realm, OSHA workers, compensation, et cetera, it has multi million dollars of impact. You can either lose millions, tens of millions, or you can save millions, tens of millions. More important, you can save lives. You can save your company's reputation. You can have limbs not be amputated. You can have kids with their moms and dads coming home that night instead of never coming home again. So don't tell me that's not urgent. That is way more urgent than marketing. That is way more urgent than sales. That is way more urgent than anything that has to do with filthy, dirty money. And we'll talk about how to frame that and how to articulate that and how to message that in the program. But you are ideally suited because on a personal level, it is about saving lives and preventing injuries. On an organizational level, it's about multi-million dollar lawsuits, fines, and permanent reputational damage. Permanent reputational damage. That's the business that Pam is in. <clears throat> All right. And Chris Kalenda is here. Fantastic to see you. You're very welcome. Great webinar, David. So excited about the future. Can't wait to talk to you, my friend. Totally fantastic. I probably missed some questions. So, uh, well, here's Ileana, actually. Let's see. My online course and coaching was created for dental practices, and this business is taking a hit with COVID-19. Well, so I have a substantial question and then a messaging question. Ileana, based on your expertise, let's not worry about what's in the course right now, because a course is an optional component of this. We talked about that. Can you help dentists and dental practices during COVID-19, either with some of that content or with completely different mentorship, guidance, advice, etc.? So that's a substantial question, yes or no. Can you help dental practices get through this crazy time? Is there a COVID-19 angle to what you could be, should be, or want to be doing, or is there really not? And Colette says, thank you for a great course. Many things to think about. Strategic reflections I'm taking in my business. Colette, you're very, very welcome. Glad you hopped on. Ileana, what do you think? Do you have some, some things? Oh, so you're saying no. So you, there's nothing, let me just be clear, there's nothing between your ears, there's nothing anywhere in your intellectual property that could help a dental practice in this crazy upside down time right now. You got nothing, you got nothing for them to do, no ideas, no insights, no recommendations, no strategies whatsoever. So you say, I've been thinking about it. Okay, well, so there's two things going on. Number one, the world is going to come back. It's not going to come back the same. It's going to come back different. So maybe your messaging is positioning the dental practice for the restart. So when things do come back and they can put patients in chairs again, they're going to be positioned ahead of their competitors who are hiding under their desk or hiding under their uh, dental chair right now. Or we strategize, you and I hop on a call and we strategize about some things that you can help them with maybe in a different or adjacent arena to what your course is about. Frankly, maybe it's nothing to do with what your course is about, and it's just some expertise or experience that you can draw on that would be a highly relevant, highly uh, valued message right now. So I, I don't know, just having this little chat here in the, uh, the webinar chat, but if you want to book a call at highfeemastery.com, we can certainly find that out together. 
All right. Fabio! I'm guessing that you're just Fabio as opposed to THE Fabio, but you never know. Maybe it's THE Fabio. Uh, how can a business consultant slash speaker from Brazil become even more relevant to U.S. clients than U.S. consultants and speakers? Well, I don't think it's about nationality. I think it's about relevance. I think it's about are you doing something that they either don't, won't, can't, or are afraid to? Think about all those words, Fabio. What are you doing as a consultant, as a speaker, as an online mentor that others, like your, your competition, they don't, they won't, they can't, or they're afraid to? They don't say it, they can't say it, they won't say it, or they're afraid to say it. So what's your edge? What's your angle? What's your perspective? What is your secret sauce that they can only get from you that they can't get from anyone else? And you know what? That question applies whether you're American, Canadian, from Brazil, from the moon. doesn't matter where you're from. Everyone needs that level of articulation and distinction. So in order for you to stand out from the crowd and decommoditize yourself, Fabio, you need some secret sauce. You need some angle. You need some uh, magnetism to what you do. And magnetism, of course, has positive and negative polarity. So you're going to repel some people away from your message, and you're going to strongly attract the right people to your message because of what you stand for and what you stand against. That is really, really important, regardless of nationality. Very, very critical. All right, um, so I think that's all of the new questions. I am so much looking forward to talking to folks. This is totally great. Um, Brian says, how do I download PDFs when clicked they don't download? And I think um, Sam probably answered that question for you in the chat. So you're all set. Rob Bell, we're talking. Uh, fantastic. Matt and I are talking. Steven, we're talking. John, I'm looking forward to talking to you. Thomas, if you want to book a call, feel free. HighFeeMastery.com. That link is still open. There's still some available slots. Tomorrow, the next day, would love to speak with you. Book your time. I will see you on your decision call. HighFeeMastery.com. That's the place to go. All right. Thank you, everybody. See you next time.